It's not yet 3 a.m. Seven months ago, I naively believe that I have all the time to do everything, everywhere, all at once. I thought I can go out, sleep properly, eat properly too, download music that I have bookmarked. There are 800 plus of them sitting in my Google room. I thought I can organize my homework, organize my homework, working out and eat the right stuff. That's why I'm recording this when I'm having a fever right now. By the time I posted this post, I have already seen how life robbing campus life is. But I'm still determined. I'm still going good at it because I lied about going out. I never did. My friends are not always like to go out too because they are in the same boat with me. Major in interior design. They said that time management is important in a design major, but the timeline looks like this. I still able to make videos before that time while still working on campus assignments. Yet here I am, 7 months apart between my last post, or 9 months apart between my last video. I was completely lost about time. I didn't have time. Now that I have finished my finals, I'm still waiting for the graduations, but I have no responsibilities at the moment. Yet, it hits me when I can't sleep at night. Perhaps there's never a moment when I will have time. According to testimonies from the internet, people complain that their work is worse than schools. By God, I barely slept during school, and I'm far from the most hardworking among my friends. I often sacrifice my scores for sleep, which is not even hitting the 8 hours rule. By the way, it's 10 hours for adolescents. During the finals at my campus, my classmates fainted after submitting their works. Two of them. People say work is worse than that. Am I missing something? How can I not worry about the future, my future right now, as well as my future family? I won't have time for them. I will become that distant, hard-working father that are emotionally unavailable for their daughter, giving them daddy issues. Then she cuts herself. Even if I might be able to stop her, I have no right to make it right anymore, because that will be my fault. Is this what they call overthinking? Perhaps. I don't think my problem is a special case though. This is pretty much common, isn't it? Pretty much everyone has the same problem. Or am I overreacting? Or am I just asking too much? Or could I just find a job that is not time consuming? Oh, but I want the money as well. Could you not? Well, honestly, I haven't even do the job hunting yet. Maybe there's hope. Aside from that, I do have seen some discussions on similar matters, and it got my interest when they bring out a chart about times when you can have a house, family, maybe a car, with one common job, compared to today's times when you can't. But this gets political. I already promised myself to not get political in this channel, which I have failed a few times. What I want to say is, I do feel hateful after knowing it. Arguments like, current times have it nicer than the past, I have doubts about that. Is it? Sometimes I talk to myself, should I go back to the woods, away from society, like a true sigma, living in a small cottage, away from the stress, having freedom? But I do love paladins. The game is full of bugs, with quite lots of anger-inducing moments and realization that people sucks. But others prove that people can be fun too. I still keep coming back to this game even long after I promised myself to not to. It's just addicting, I guess. About my campus life, I don't sleep, I don't socialize. I work all the time from waking up to sleep again. With COVID stuffs, 
work from home save my commuting money and times. Yet, did my work pay off? Am I an expert now in interior design? Interior design? Can't tell. No, I have good grades. I did working seriously on my assignments. Yet I still feel <coughs> yet I still feel insecure. During those seven months, the fact that I cannot make videos during that period, can I say I was dead during that time? My social life has zero progress. Well maybe not absolutely zero, but that's how I feel. There were times when I can't do a specific task because of the situation, maybe because I cannot be in front of my computer during the time. So I get myself busy with something else, like learning Japanese, because I'm a fucking weep. And I learn electro swing dance to keep my body healthy, and it's fun. You should try it too. Yeah, did those seven months can make up for the rest of my future. Well, some people say it's obviously, yes, but I myself not sure about the answer. It's just that uncertain. Also, my parents don't know the definition of resting. But hey, it's perfectly normal to have stressful days, right? It's not normal if it never happens. Maybe I shouldn't just thinking about preventing the stress, but also about dealing with it head on. Like this, making videos is fun. Maybe I just need to have fun once in a while and shut down my evolutionary instinct to worry about things. Just because it's an arguably good trait doesn't mean it is always helpful all the time. I watched a particular meme videos recently. It's wacky. And the world can be wacky sometimes, and I absolutely love that. Maybe, arguably, my mistake is thinking about the future, while I probably should just be thinking about Siberian Huskies and anime girls being silly. Perhaps I do have control over time. Subscribe.